Hey everybody, this is Dr. Thomas Lamar, and I am super excited to be behind the microphone right now as I am recording the audiobook for Scott LaPierre's brand new book that just hit the Amazon storefront, A Father Offers His Son, The True and Greater Sacrifice Revealed Through Abraham and Isaac. And whoa, this is a great book. Scott has done an amazing job mining the depths of an account that most of us are familiar with. I thought I was familiar with it. I thought I was maybe more familiar than most with it until I read Scott's book. (laughs) There is so much depth to this. Um, It's just blowing me away. I'm looking forward to sharing it with my family. We're going to do a book study. Um, It's going to be great. I want to encourage you to go get the book on Amazon uh, and super encourage you to get the audio book. And as a matter of fact, I'm going to give you just a quick little snippet of what the audio book is sounding like as I continue to record this. We're on chapter 10, and uh, we'll see how this goes. Um, Might make an error. I don't know. (laughs) Stand by. Here we go. Chapter 10. The Lamb That Makes Christianity the Opposite. Genesis 22.8. And Abraham said, My son, God will provide for himself the lamb for a burnt offering. So the two of them went together. Abraham's words seem absurd. God would provide a lamb for the sacrifice to him? Religion is about what man does. That is what makes it worship. Man brings something that will please. Man offers something to appease. At the heart of other religions are individuals bringing sacrifices to the false gods they worship. But at the heart of Christianity is a God who provides the sacrifice himself. This does not just make Christianity different from other religions. It makes Christianity the opposite of other religions. That was good. We're going to keep that one and we're going to move on. Make sure you get the audio book. We'll talk to you later. God bless.